Hey guys, today we're going to create a simple script that interacts with CoinMarketCap's API. This is a great step towards understanding APIs and working with backend technology. This will be a great beginner level tutorial for programmers and anyone who has an interest in Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. All right, let's get started. So some prerequisites. You're going to need to have Python or Python 3 installed, which you could do through Brew. If you don't have Brew installed to install Python, watch my Brew install video. You're going to need pip to install any missing libraries, a code editor like Notepad++, Sublime, or Visual Studio, and last, a CoinMarketCap account to get an API key. Let's go to pro.coinmarketcap.com and create our API key. Go ahead and create a free account. Be sure to pick the basic tier plan for free use. Once you have all that, go ahead and log in. Once you're logged in, you'll see a dashboard. This is where you'll see your API key. Hover over this and click copy key. The dashboard will also show you how many API calls you've made. There's also a link to the API documentation. So let's go ahead and take a look at that next. Once you're in the documentation, just click on quick start guide, scroll down, select the Python code, and copy this and put it inside of our text editor. So I prefer to use Visual Studio Code. I'm going to create a new file. I'm going to paste the copied code. I'm going to change this to Python. Okay, we're gonna to need to change a few things. So with the URL, you can take a look at the different endpoints that we're gonna to need to do, use our API calls on. We're gonna change the parameters and we're gonna change the API key. We're gonna get the API key from the dashboard. So let's go ahead and do that first. I go back to CoinMarketCap's dashboard and grab my API key. I'm gonna paste it in. Next, I look at the documentation, and I want to do API calls for quotes. Last, I'm going to change the parameters to ID of 1. All right, I'm going to save the file. All right, we have our Python file here. Make sure it's a Python file with a .py. And we're going to launch it using Terminal. Since I'm using Python 3, I will type in Python 3. And I will drag and drop this file in. Press Enter. And here's our first API call. As you can see, this is the current coin, Bitcoin, the symbol, BTC. Here's the current price for Bitcoin. All right, so what's next? I would suggest learning how to parse through this information. We could also automate this so that it sends us price alerts to our emails or our texts. And congratulations, you've made your first API call using the CoinMarketCap API. We'll continue building on this in further videos. I'll leave all necessary links as well as a link to my GitHub so that you can grab the code easily. Leave any questions or comments below and give me a like and subscribe for more tech tutorials. Thank you.